Today we checked out the women's football and the fencing team. And not only that, we also have had some medals. It is all happening here. Welcome back to the official Maccabi GB Daily Roundup at this year's European Maccabi Games 2019. My name is Ashley. And I am Rotem. And this morning we headed to the first game of the women's football against Germany. Let's see how it went. This first win for the UK GB Open Women's Football Team sees them in a great standing for the rest of the tournament. With upcoming games against Hungary and the United States, they stand within a great chance of getting a medal and we can't wait to see what happens with this amazing group of women. Uh, first game, obviously my first Maccabee as well, so uh, please, please to get off the, uh, get starting with a win. Girls played really well, thought the performance was good. Um, in general, yeah, really pleased, a couple of things to work on, but yeah, we're good. Congratulations ladies, it was amazing to see you beat Germany in, the, in your first game of the competition. Yeah, you were amazing. And after the football, we decided to head to a sport we actually never seen before. So this is how it went in fencing. With only four fencing athletes, we got to spend a lot of time with them and we're so happy that already the juniors have got a gold and a bronze medal and the Open have already taken a bronze medal. So we're so happy that there's already medals coming in for Team Maccabi GB. It's definitely all happening right now. And because it was the first time we got to see fencing, we decided it's a great opportunity to learn a little bit more about fencing and maybe even try it out. So if I understand correctly, the different fencing names are after the different swords? Yes. So we have foil, sabre and epic. This is a sabre. This is the old horseback weapon where the rider would chop down from the horseback aiming for the heads and the arms. So the target is above the body. Next. Wait, did you get all of that? Yeah! Next we have foil. This weapon was used for practicing in, in the medieval times and you would, you would only aim for the chest and the back. It's hitting with the point and you're just trying to touch them. And finally you have epee, 
the last weapon is the dueling weapon. Mm -hmm. it, was to, it was used to fight to the death. This means that when you hit together, you both get a point. If I tried to stab you anywhere on your body, head to toe, it's all targets. Ooh. That, that, that would be my sword. <laughs> fight to the death. Yeah. But... Shall we do some basic moves then? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. Okay, to start off with, we stand with our feet at right angles. That hip this is apart and our knees bent. This is really important for balance and fence. So to step forward, I'll step towards you and I'll show you how to start. You step forward, heel to toe, and you bring the back foot up. And then backwards, same, back foot first. It's very similar to Rotem's crab dance. And it is! <laughs> very similar. Yeah. Okay, this is the basic movement you use to move forwards. If I go forwards first and Rotem thinks that I come first, she goes backwards out of the way. Simple. Okay? Okay. Hey. So, now the swords. Which one do you want? Uh, the FBI. Make it go. The move you do to hit the person is we extend our arm, we kick our front foot out, and then we extend our back leg. Okay. Really good. Yeah. Okay? So, Rotan, do you want to try and hit me? Yes, I will. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I poked him! <laughs> the death! Oh, my goodness! Put it on and leave it on. Yeah? Yeah. There you go. Rotem, I think you need some of those of true fighter noises like ha! Yeah, I love you. <laughs> ha! 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 Now step forward. Ha! <laughs> and hit. Ha! Nice. Ha! Ha! You are a born killer. Yeah. <laughs> be careful, be careful. I'm scared now. You put it. Yeah. Get out of here, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it, I love it. I, I honestly think that fencing is is my sport. I mean, did you see that? Did you did, did you see that? We saw the mat. Can we enter her into the next? Uh... I, I think she's a shoe in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think Richard, Richard should be concerned about his place. Yeah. <laughs> Richard, thank you so so much. Thank you very much. Good luck. Good luck. That rounds up another great day of sports and we are so proud of all the athletes that we've met so far. It is clear that Team GB are already dominating the games and we are hoping for plenty more medals in the next few days. Thank you so much for watching the third episode of the official Maccabi GB Daily Roundups. If you just join us today, make sure you go back and catch up with the two first episodes because the opening ceremony, for example, you have to watch. And remember, as always, if you'd like to follow the action closer, then make sure that you go and like and follow our Instagram and Facebook pages because we are storing all day, every day to bring you closer to the action live. Also, we're going to have scores, updates, competitions and more. So make sure you stay up to date. That is all we have time for today. Please leave us a comment in the comments below because we want to know how you feel, what you think and the athletes would love to have your support. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.